Hey guys, my name is Brittany. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, sure you lie made anyone from Sonic? <laughs> Hell yeah. <clears throat> if you know, you know, as the kids say. So today I'm going to do something that I've never done before. I did a huge order from a company called Shein or Sheen, Shein, Shein, Shein. Anyways, I did a huge order. I spent about $500. <laughs> And that was me cutting back because they had such cute stuff. And I've never ordered from there before. I am literally just so excited about the items I got. This is the second time I'm filming this video because I felt like I needed to be more organized and get my SHIT together. So if you guys are wanting to see a huge Shein haul, go ahead and stay tuned. Oh, important details. First and foremost, I am plus sized. I'm sure you can tell from the other content on my channel or whatever. Normally in a top, I'll wear a 2X or a 3X. In a bottom, I will wear 3X. Usually if it is true plus size, not junior plus, I cannot fit into a 3X and junior plus. And I'm gonna show you guys what I have on now so you guys can get a good idea of my body shape and style and all that jazz. I didn't tie my little thing. Well, that will jump back. This is my shape. You can tell that like I am very much the widest right around here. Hips and stomach area. That's usually where I have issues with things like fitting right. But this um, fit that I'm wearing right now, literally the most comfortable jumpsuit I've ever owned. This is from Tara Lynn Boutique. My friend is an ambassador for there. So you can use her code and get 10% off. I will leave that listed below. Like I said, I'm a size 24. I ordered anywhere from four or five X and everything just cause I heard you have to go up in sizes. Let's jump into it. Okay guys, so this first fit is giving me very much like that dark academia vibes. I look so freaking cute right now. They're all in the size four X for these. First, we've got the sweater. It is so soft. I can't even begin to tell you. It's got these little cuffed sleeves, so they kind of balloon out. And it has got these really cute little unfinished type buttons. I just love it. I would get this hands down in another color. And I will list the price and everything below, sizes and everything, in case I miss anything. Underneath this, I've got this cute little like jumper dress thing. It's pretty short. I mean, I'm 5'5", five five, so it's not, it's just a couple of inches above my knee. But the great thing about it is you can crisscross it in the back or you can wear it straight because it has buttons and little adjustable pieces right here. So it's got about three options for you to button up, which is really great. This top, I got it in a pack of three. It's got this little knotted detail. It's very cropped. This feels like a good size. I really like this outfit, especially with the sweater and everything. So I am happy about all of these purchases and they all feel like really good quality for the price. Next, this is also one of my favorite items. This is giving me Sunday afternoon brunch vibes. These are a animal print pant, but they've got like these overall suspenders. That's so cute. Now the difference with these is there is no option to adjust them. I do you think wearing them higher up is more my vibe? I especially think it looks cute with this little crop situation. So I might have to like pin them or just sew them so they're a little bit tighter. But honestly, these are so cute. I love these and I've just paired it with that same crop from before. They're just super stretchy, you guys. These I also got in a 4X. Oof, okay guys, so they can't all be winners, right? So this is in a 4X. It is, I think in the picture it looks like a dress. It's definitely too short to be a dress, but I wanted to show you guys like how it actually fit on me while you can see, you know, what the picture is online. The other thing is right here, it's a, t a little tight it's right around my belly. I'm not like too upset about it because if I ever wore this, I'd wear it with probably leggings or something like that on the bottom, obviously. So I wouldn't mind like rolling it up a little bit. I do find it weird that it's short in the front, but like very long in the back. Do you see what I mean? It's definitely not a gradual. It's just like so long. I also feel like 
the arms are a little big they do have like little buttons that i don't have buttoned but you know for the most part this isn't too bad let me show you guys what i got to go with it to kind of like dress it up this sweater vest i also picked up because i thought it would be cute to pair over the dress but like i said even though this doesn't fit me like a dress that i would wear as a dress for me personally i still love the sweater vest i watched clueless before i did this order and you will see some heavily influenced pieces today from the movie Clueless. This sweater vest is in a 3X. I think this is maybe one of the smallest pieces that I got. I love it. It's a very like classic print. It feels great. Like it's nice and thick. So I'm very happy with this. I also picked up this fun little clasp for the uh, neckline of any collared shirts. Cause like how cute is that? Just like it's the little details, right? Looking like a Halloween baddie. Okay, I'm kidding. Oh my God, please. <laughs> <laughs> don't judge me or do who cares so doing that little motion right there that little this bodysuit just unsnapped so I think it's a little too small the fabric is interesting it's like stretchy but it almost feels like stretchy in the wrong places like I don't have enough stretch for it to feel like really comfortable when I'm wearing it like especially at the bottom it feels almost too short but the the arms seem to be like a little too big but it's got this square neckline so maybe I don't know I do like the neckline I hate bodysuits so I don't know why I bought this but I do kind of like the neckline this is in a 4x on top part of me thinks maybe I should have gone a size up because of the length but I don't know if I would have loved it in a size up I don't hate it these pants though well now this is a misrepresentation so these are actually a 5x in the pants and you can see they're pretty tight they're not like tight like uncomfortable they're just kind of like stretchy pants and they definitely let me try and get up here you see this texture right here but it definitely feels like church clothes my grandma used to wear. You know what I mean? Like nice, nice clothes, but like back in the day. I think these two pieces are the first I would really consider sending back. Okay, next we have this cute little cropped halter. This is in the size 4X as well. You can see it's a little cropped in the back and that I'd have to wear it like a little high. But for the most part, I really like it. It's a very, very thin material. But I could see myself lounging in a pair of sweats or something with this on. Like honestly, like this kind of fit, especially when it's super hot out. And the shirt was really inexpensive. So overall, I like this. I think for the, the price and the design is really cute. Also, I got these earrings. And there's a sun and a moon, so I feel like we're vibing, right? We're vibing. Next shirt is this animal print shirt. I feel like I got quite a few of these just like printed crop tops, but this one is like a triangle in the middle, which that I thought was pretty cute. The back, kind of a similar situation. I'd probably need a different bra with it. Honestly, it fits super good. This is an A4X as well. And the thing I really like about this shirt that most of the other shirts don't have is it's got a little adjustable strap. So you can make it a little bit higher up which I like. I'm happy with this one as well. Y'all, getting old is a trip. I just had to take a break and take an allergy pill at like 10 o'clock at night when I'm filming this. <laughs> I never had allergies before, but now I do. Isn't that fun? Okay, what's also fun? This shirt. Okay, okay. Honestly, Gen Z, I'm here for you. Listen, I'm a millennial. I don't know if I'm like a geriatric millennial i do think y'all are wrong for that 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 term or whoever came up with that but i am a millennial and i think gen z is just the bee's knees i really do i think millennials are great too but like i re i really love like the fashion and stuff and i know that like cow print is in <laughs> i set my phone background as this and i really thought when cow print first started i was gonna be like oh <laughs> no not me that one i can't get on board with but clearly i can so my boyfriend he's like oh Oh no, not the country print. It's the country print. This shirt is probably one that is like the worst quality so far. It's very thin. And I mean, I still like the way it looks. I'm just a little worried about it, me actually rocking it. This is in a 5X. The way it fits on the top, it's kind of loosey goosey, which I think I can fix with just like making it really tight around my neck. I probably could have sized down. It's kind of seeming like I could wear a 4X in this, most of these clothes. We don't love it, but I think I'll still keep it. Um, okay. Ah. 
<laughs> oh my god i love this outfit okay we love it first of all these shorts they're like the very flowy short that you can't tell from the side is it a skirt is it a short it's shorts but they are almost like constructed in a way that like them being shorts only helps a little bit because like on the side very flowy but i love this i love the color i think it's super cute and the top this was a set that came together how cute is this this gave me very clueless vibes because the girl had it like buttoned like this get out of here in the little promo now this top set is a 3x and the shorts are a 4x i think this is the perfect size for this my only criticism about this particular fit is i wish that the shorts had pockets everything else i love i love this outfit this is a 10 out of 10 catch me rocking this in my house because I don't really go anywhere. A A A. What in the Ronald McDonald cosplay? So this top is a cropped top. It looked like it had a lot more construction on the website, but truly, y'all, it is just two pieces of fabric that you tie together in the front. You could honestly probably like tie it like this, but I don't have enough fabric, so you just zoop and you can tie it in the front. You can tie it in a knot or a bow. Do your chain hang. It's actually really cute. It's pretty cropped. Like I said, you know, you just tie it right under your boobs but I almost feel like with this kind of like outfit I'm not mad at it I mean I am because this is just a little bit too country for me with the yellow well it's two McDonald's right we got the red we got the yellow I'm a clown so like it's hitting a little bit too close to home for me but I actually really like this top I got this one in a 5x for the most part it's kind of hard for me to tell how their sizing works because at some point I felt like okay 4x is for sure my size in this brand but sometimes a 3x works and feels good and then this 5x like I don't think I really could have gone much smaller no idea if this is gonna count as like a fit but is anyone else excited for Halloween because I am clearly I was like pretty much done shopping when I realized that they had pajamas which like why wouldn't they have pajamas but I didn't really think of them for pajamas so oh my gosh i got these halloween themed pajamas or honestly just skeleton themed they don't have to be halloween they could be july themed pajamas i live for a pair of pajamas and also these hands on the boobs i love this i will wear this crop i'll just wear it because it's cute with some high-waisted jeans they're very soft they're like stretchy cottony material and i got this in a 4x which was the biggest size they had in this so i'm really happy that this fits i'm vibing with this dress oh my gosh it is maybe like an inch above my knee and it is just a flowy gorgeousness it's got these like wing sleeves kind of but they balloon out at the front it's kind of just like a shift dress pretty boxy but the best feature is this print which has these is this is a stork what is this a stork anyways all over it especially towards the bottom this is in a 5x i actually think i probably could have gone down a size because i would like a little bit more structure in the dress like right here but i actually think i can probably take it in just a bit right here oh my gosh it is so pretty i just think wow like what a statement piece and it was so inexpensive i think i know i'll have all the prices listed below but i think this dress with the discount was 11 dollars get out of here i had to turn my fan on y'all it is getting toasty in here we're like only halfway through the hall okay this fit i bought because of sarah ray vargas <clears throat> excuse me this is a set they have so many sets on this site and i don't know if it's just because i'm lazy in my older age but the set pieces had me die like i loved them so this set had me so happy when i saw it on her, on sarah ray vargas because she mentioned like it was just like kind of like cool badass now it's pretty tight on me i got it in a 4x which was the biggest size that they had for the set so i definitely could have gone up a size if it was available i think the most like the part i can tell the most by is just this little cut because these are shorts but it has this little flap that kind of makes it look like a skirt Ooh, excuse me Ooh, it's a cherry limeade baby but obviously like 
they didn't have the size so I just decided to take a chance and I'm glad I did. I love how this top has this little piece of fabric that you can wear. You can kind of tuck it up and then it's just like completely gone. But I really like this idea of like the little strip, especially if you're kind of like new to crop tops and trying to see how you feel. Okay y'all, if I was still going out, I mean I don't go out anymore, but if I was, I would wear this, but I don't, so. <laughs> but I think it's so freaking cute. I definitely recommend. Okay, wait a minute. I did get one pair of shoes, and I was looking at the outfits, and I was like, I think this be the best outfit to try them out in. <laughs> Who is she? Um, Sorry, but I love them. Gremlin, stop licking my legs. They look like cotton candy. What? And they're actually like so comfortable and so light. Oh my God, I love these. We love... They're just so fun. Oh my gosh, they're so light. Like I was not expecting that. And they're squishy. It's like walking on little cloud air things. I love it. Little pillow top for your feet. Okay, sorry, I'm going to the tennis club. Okay, no, I'm sorry. I, from, I'm acting a fool. I'm probably sleep deprived. I got another sweater vest. I got this in a 4X as well. It's just very much like a basic baby pink situation. Like I said, I was watching Clueless. So I just thought that this was cute. I like it. Once again, I think it's really good quality. This is like more breathable than the first sweater vest I showed you but still very cute simple easy to pair I really like this one when I say y'all better never let me buy another sweater vest I mean it I promise this is the last one though this one is cropped you can tell the other ones were like quite a bit longer so this one's cropped and it has like a cable knit detail on the front once again it's kind of oversized easy to wear i thought i would pair it with like a skirt yeah, i'm really liking like the edgy vibe of pairing it with this like bot this like bottom on this set really stands alone it's just like such a cute addition this is an a4x as well it's cute right it's cute <laughs> happy pride now i have this really super colorful shirt i just really like the way that it looked and and it's a lot of fun. I got this in a 5X. I feel like it fits really well, like good size, high back. It's obviously like a crop, but it's not as cropped as other shirts. It is very shiny. It almost seems like a cheap costume. I don't know. I feel like you could still rock it. It would still be cute with a lot of different outfits. So I think I'll keep it. This is another set. It came with this cute little white crop and this like olive green skirt set now this is in a 4x this bottom is the first one that I was really like I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get this on because it doesn't have very much stretch but it does and because I have it so high-waisted that's why I can wear it any lower and I wouldn't have been able to get it on you can see like here just like how tight it is but honestly like if it didn't have this little wrap in the front I wouldn't like it just because I don't know I just wouldn't have loved it but with this little like extra panel it's so cute to me and like I love like the asymmetrical like leg. I don't know. I just feel like very fun and fancy free. It's just a lot of like fun. This is cute. This is a summer fit. I'm about to go. <laughs> Nowhere because these dang allergies. Okay, anyways, I do like this outfit. Before I change, I wanna show you guys this sweater. It's a super cropped sweater. This is also in a 4X. The construction is questionable. I don't think there's much construction. It's kind of like a bolero. You guys remember those? They're like little cap sleeve things if you wanted to hide your arms. This is definitely not the vibe. I don't care if people have to look at my arms, but I just thought it would be like fun to have like this little crop situation. It's a little bit baggier than I would have liked. I know it was supposed to be an oversized fit, but it kind of almost feels like a little sloppy, which some days that's what I'm going for. Some days I like a sloppy outfit, but I don't know. This will be a maybe for a keep because I'm not sure if I'll wear it enough to justify like keeping it just because like, I don't know, I just feel like it's kind of shapeless. Anyways. Next outfit. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I got another sweater. Can you guys tell I was feeling the fall vibes? Because this, like, burnt orange color. Oof. Yes. It has a little bit of a, like, sleeve to close it off. It's got 
pockets. The color is phenomenal. And it's like this woven material. It's very soft and it's pretty long, longer than the skirt I'm wearing right now. I like this, this will be easy for me to throw on, especially during the fall, especially if I have to go to work or whatever. So I like this, this whole fit, two thumbs up. I also like the color combo of the green and this like orangey brown color. I wouldn't wear these together because I don't like the style combo, but I do like the color. What do you guys think? Do you hate it or do you love it? Let me know. <laughs> Okay, this fit, Ooh. okay, I love it. This is one of the fits that I can tell I was watching Clueless right before I got on. Oof, it's a little short, but so it is a houndstooth suit, excuse me. The bodysuit underneath, I don't care for at all. I thought I was really gonna like it. Honestly, I just feel like I'm about to come to a gender reveal party and I don't vibe. I don't love the suit or the bodysuit. I didn't even clip it at the bottom, so. But it's you know, one of the only tops I have left that I think would look good with this. However, the blazer is so freaking cute. Both the bodysuit and the actual houndstooth suit are in 4X. The skirt is pretty short and pretty tight, but it's not really bother me much. I think I could wear it a little bit lower and maybe even pair it with some shapewear if I'm feeling that, especially if I wanted to wear it for work, but I love it. It's got a faux pocket, which is okay, but it's got some really cute detail like it's got some buttons and the skirt actually has matching buttons on it as well just the construction is really nice and for summer like this is so nice and i really like the idea that i can have like this bold houndstooth statement piece like i'm sorry what also, I got these earrings. Please do not disturb. They're so much bigger than I thought. Like I could put these on an actual hotel door, but honestly like, yeah, please leave me alone. How, oh, 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 get out of my hair. How cute are these? They're like little stars, just like hanging. But they're so freaking cute. I think like having my hair up when I wore something like this would be darling. Okay, but now that you guys see the earrings, shimmering let me show you the fit oh lord if i don't look like i'm in somebody church choir <laughs> what are you doing maybe it's because i'm getting tired but holy moly okay can you tell i went a little crazy when they said they had matching sets i did okay so this set i just thought was like such a talk about popping popping i forgot it came with this Hi, these bows always blow my mind because I'm like, are we tying in the front or are we tying in the back? I guess it depends on what your vibe is. I don't know, you guys. Like, this is gonna sound silly, but I don't know. I think it's just too matchy for me. I love the idea of a match set, but the construction just isn't there with this. Like, the bottoms are basically just straight up leggings, which is fine. We love a like a comfy legging, but I feel like with the top being a peplum or whatnot, you get no opportunity to break up the print. Like at least with the last outfit, it was a blazer and skirt combo. So you can put whatever kind of shirt you want underneath. Something that could help this outfit is like a brown belt. I would love to see this with a brown belt and maybe just like a bold, cute shoe, but I don't know. I don't know if I would reach for this enough to make it worth keeping. I also don't love peplums. Like I feel like sometimes they hit too high and they look like pregnancy shirts on me, which I just don't, I just don't love the look of. So kind of a miss for me. So, but what do you guys think? Do I look like I'm going to church? Like best dress in church though? Maybe not best dress, okay. <laughs> mm, I hate this shirt. I hate it so freaking much oh where to start okay first of all i tried the shirt on in my first haul i knew 100 as soon as i took it out of the bag i would not keep it the material is freaking awful it feels like i'm wearing paper like crepey paper on my body it's so uncomfortable Ooh, i just hate it not to mention that like i love the concept of the bow and all this stuff but i know you guys can see through the side i'd probably wear something underneath it if i was gonna wear it my real thought was to put one of those cute sweater vests over it but it doesn't even fit fully at the bottom i don't know if you can see like it's supposed to probably lay like this but 
it won't. It's just a little too small. This is in a 4X and it's just not a vibe. I hate it and I cannot wait to get it off my body. This is 100% getting returned. <laughs> Um, yeah, yeah, I like this a lot. Okay, guys, I, this suit is in a 4X. It's matchy matchy again. I love this suit. Okay, can I button it? Um, yes, but I don't love it buttoned. And these pockets are real. They just have to be opened up. I just love this. I kind of look like I'm about to host a game show. Hi, I'm Brittany and this is The Price is Right. Oh my God, someone hire me. Okay, the pants are very, very stretchy. They're a 4X and they've got belt loops, which I like because I actually might rock these with a belt. I don't mind tucking stuff into pants like this. I don't mind wearing tight ass pants at work. Like my belly is what it is. I like being fashionable and I like feeling good about the clothes I put on my body. So um, I really like these. The bottom, the length I feel like is good. This is obviously like a summer suit. I just love it. Honestly, I just love a statement blazer as well. So just having a blazer like this, like, oh my gosh, I really like it. This top obviously doesn't go with it. This top is something separate so the top is very shiny it's kind of like a faux silk shirt in the like picture online the girl had it like very cropped like this with a pair of jeans i actually really like this shirt i do kind of feel like it's fancy pajamas but i feel like you can dress it up so well like even buttoning it down and talk tucking it into a nice pair of like denim and just like rocking with some heels I think it looks so cute. So I'm not mad at this shirt. It definitely feels pajama-y. And I got this in a size 5X. Both of these are wins. And this suit was the thing I was the most concerned about. And I'm so happy. Like, I'm so happy. Oh my God. This is the second to last fit. And wow, she's coming through. Couple things. First, this was another set. So you got the shorts. I mean, they're pretty short. I have them super high-waisted right now because of the shirt I'm wearing. But the shorts come with a little tie in the front and this cute little blazer. They're all made out of the same material. So lightweight. Feels very much pajama-y again. This is like a very easy constructed outfit. There's no buttons, there's no zippers, there's, you know, this little tie if you want to use it. And then I paired it with the final shirt I had. This was just a cute little pink crop. This tops in a 4X. I'm very surprised because this outfit, like I said, is in a 3X and it fits super good. I do plan on probably wearing this lower down when I wear it with a shirt that isn't cropped, but I love this. This is like another great brunch outfit. Somebody take me out to brunch. Okay, well let's go out to brunch together, okay? This is so cute. Oh my goodness, I love this outfit. All right guys, there's only one left. So this is the last fit. It is a pajama set with a feather in it. It comes with this blue robe and these stretchy cotton shorts. And it also comes with a matching blue tank. But before I put the whole set on, I wanted to show you guys, I did get a bralette. I'm obsessed with bralettes. It's got a little rainbow at the bottom, which I thought was so cute, but I really like the construction of this. There is nothing better than coming home after work and throwing on a bralette. Anyway, I wouldn't normally wear a bra with this set or this bralette, but I already got the bra on. I'm just trying to get through it. This is the set and obviously like you can wear it however you want, but like, is it just me or oh no i feel like i got my life together when i'm wearing a coordinated outfit like this i just feel like yes come to me i filed my taxes this year i have a 401k i knew why i picked the health insurance plan that i picked that's what this is saying to me you know what i mean oh my god you guys I gotta sit down i'm tired oh my god that took two hours to film 
Lord have mercy. Okay, my first time shopping at Sheen. I spent $500 after the discount. So like before the discount, it was like a $600 haul. But there was 20% off and lots of stuff was on sale. So thank you guys for spending time with me. I hope you really enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed this video and you made it all the way to the end, please like and comment. It really does help my channel and consider subscribing. I do all kinds of content. I do lifestyle vlogs, deep dive videos into like fun topics and definitely I can add some more plus size fashion into the mix if you guys are interested in that so please subscribe I'm gonna get out of here and go lay on a couch and stare at a wall somewhere all of the items sizes and links will be below in the bottom bar and I'll see you in the next one <sighs> bye Okay, sorry, my camera died. The actual disrespect to the fan catching that.